excellent connection live there. That says live, but the stream preview says offline, so let me refresh the page real fast. And we're live. Hello, World Wide Web. I'm Dark Shadow, the Internet Personality of here. And welcome to Forklift Low. Ah, now, this is a, a, another gift from Xenathus, I should say. They've been very, very generous. I thank you very much. Uh, this one, how am I feeling tonight? Uh, <laughs> night of sarcasm. It's. It's been a time. <laughs> it's been a time. <laughs> but we got forklift load, so maybe we'll start feeling a little bit better. <laughs> Oof. Now, this got recommended to me on Steam, and I was there like, you, you, you got a, you got a low-end indie ass game from Kimidori Soft here who specialize in low-ass indie-ass, indie like, shovelware for Steam. But this one is a little puzzix, puzzle simulation kind of game about operating a forklift. Couldn't stay away from the forklifts? No, I... I, I the, the, Ryo is a, is a bad influence. Uh, let's see. We've got our settings, languages in the Englishness, and, uh... Invert vertical, invert heart. What? Uh, I'm just gonna exit for now and hope that there's no problem. New game. Okay, what's what's the what's the story here? We got we're playing it for the plot, as you know. I'm an AI robotics engineer and researcher. I'm in the midst of developing a whole new environmental adaptive AI. I listen to this music all the time during development. Listening to this music helps me work better. It's decades old, but I've been listening to this music for a long time. Me? Hey. The music player is also quite old, a magnetic tape audio player. Even though it broke down, I used it while repairing it, and it's probably the only one that exists today. Is that all? Very old. Let's get back to the point. Uh, when this AI is perfected, it will be possible to automate all the production activities that humans currently do using AI. So, then we will be able to do only what we like and enjoy doing, and our lives will be far richer! Heroic forklift! Okay. Okay, so AI is going to automate... The stuff we currently use AI to automate, or his program will automate the... Oh, the pink forklift is talking to us! Oh, sir, good morning! Suddenly you were forced to shut down and stop working, and then you didn't start for three days! I worried you so much! <laughs> but I'm glad you got it rebooted successfully! Okay, we, we have a fantastic translation already! It's not nerdish to read. Let's get right to work today. First of all, can you hand me the drum with the fuel in it? When I give it to you, please step back slowly so you don't drop it. Perhaps you have forgotten how to operate it. Use the ESC key to open the pause menu and check it out from there. There are more features, so if you're having trouble, take a look at the pause menu. Just We're not going to explain the controls in the tutorial. We're just going to have to... We're just gonna have to trust that you go into the tutorial, you dang self. Also, I think it's a little bit on the loud side. Let's dial it back, dial it back. Actually, no. I, I, I keep it back up there, keep it back up there. What we gotta do is go into the ESC menu. We gotta, what we gotta do is go into the ESC menu. And... Turn down the music a damn self this way. Yeah. That's too low. There we go. And put the S-E over there. There we go. There we go. I, that way we can have our nice... Have, a, have our nice... Properly balanced game audio, and we can still hear the alerts from Twitch. 
Okay, what the hell? Okay, back, accelerate, jump? I got a jump button? Upper fork, lower fork, submit. Uh, break. Wait, break is, okay, I guess handbrake is X. Where's left trigger is just backup. Okay, steering, map is map button. Okay, cool, pause is pause button. Great. All right. Oh boy, oh boy, oh. Whoa, okay. Oh, okay. Um, hmm. Well, sir, can I get a good view, please? All right, all right, no problem, no problemo. Just slide on in here with our forklifty powers. Oh, that's down. Okay, whoa, yeah, we Omen with the forklifting. Nice, nice music for this. Okay. Um, but pink. Won't it be weird when you just drop the pallet right on your forks? Like, you're not gonna be able to... Well, good luck. That's it? Even though it's right after the reboot, it's a senior citizen that accomplishes it effortlessly. What the fuck you call- what? The key to doing well is to use the tab key to switch to a viewpoint that's easier to see. Oh, thanks for telling me that now. That's what my seniors used to say. Oh. Okay. Next, hand the drum straight ahead of you here to Mr. Blue at the exit. Mr. Blue is over there. It's a bit far, so please be careful. All right. God damn. Uh, okay. Tab. Okay. Whoa, whoa, okay, okay, okay. So we got a forklift view there. We got our... Oh, that's a... Okay, we got the side... Right by the side fork view. And then we got the free around view. Okay. How do we change the view with the controller? Okay, that's our jump button. Handy. Uh, down up, down up, break. That, 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 that. Okay, well, um... I don't seem to be able to change the view without the tab key. I can't actually do that with the controller. We, we, we got the left and right bumper. They just don't do anything. You could easily put the key there, but they don't. <laughs> oh, well. Now, we could put the key there ourselves if we want to go into Steam Input and set it to a custom... custom button. Oh, no. Oh, jeez. It's all rocking around. I'm used to Shenmue just going right in there, and it's... Whoa. No, no. Up, 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 up. Okay, okay. All right, jeez. Whoa, 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 jeez. Careful, careful. It's still... Okay, I gotta be careful with this shit. It's not like Shenmue where... Jesus, that is not a good view. What are you doing? Oh, goddamn. Game, please. Game, please. Jesus Christ. Okay. Trying to go backwards not very easy, considering when you have something in your forks that affects your... That, that, that's considered geometry to the camera, and it... <laughs> it's like, oh, that must be blocking your view. Let me help you. I'll, I'll just go in front of that. Like, no! So, there's a post-apocalyptic situation. We are right, running a forklift. We're not even in it. We're not even in it. It's a remote-controlled forklift. Go oh, crap! <laughs> oh, damn it! <laughs> oh, I lost a barrel. Let's try that again. Next hand. Okay, we start from the drum mission. That's 
Not as bad as it could be. Whoa, camera. Could you? Well, shit. Yeah, thank you. All right. My forks are already that height. Okay, let's let's zero in our forks. Break. Sure. Okay, we gotta line this up. All right. All right. Line up our forks. Okay. Now? Now? Break. All right. Oh, who secured this load? I don't know. They should have wrapped those damn barrels up. You don't just throw shit loose on a pallet. I know that. Decker will find a way to do the barrel roll. Always does. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, we went that way. Let's go this way this time. Trying to break before I start accelerating in another direction just so that I have a little bit of reprieve. Like, it doesn't... I'm not whipping the load around like crazy. It's so much easier in Shenmue when you can just... Just go full bore, turning on a dime, like a nutsos into buttsos, and there you go. I still don't. Okay, I see the thing where blue wants me. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Here we are. Break. Break. Jesus. That has sucked. Good job. Thanks. Next time, help me out with the outside. I left the exit for you. What? <laughs> uh, do I gotta lift up the exit? I just drive towards it, okay. <laughs> Glad this isn't first person. <laughs> what the heck? Is that Honda Accord have something to say? Civilian. Excuse me, I need your help. I'm out of fuel and can't move. Can you please go ahead and bring the fuel to me? Anyway, here, I... On the way here, I found fuel. Why didn't you fucking take it then? You do not see a fuel gauge? You're like riding on E and you're passing the gas station like, well, if I run out, at least I know where it is. Like, what? <laughs> Ooh, gas barrel, senpai. All right, you lazy bastard, I'll get you fuel. Woohoo! Okay. Line this puppy up. No idea where this thing... Okay. okay. And they call him Forklift Man. Hey, since this is not Shenmue, though, I think it would behoove me to 
have my load a bit lower to the ground, have a bit better of a center of gravity so I can go a little bit faster. Though this is just one barrel, so it's not that big of a... Going up the ramp would be a great idea. Uh, not right now, it wouldn't. No, 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 we're gonna... We're gonna go down that ramp. Carefully. So I might want to back down that ramp, honestly. <sighs> okay. Alright, boom. Nice. <laughs> the car <laughs> appears behind me with a butcher knife. Wouldn't put it past it. Would not put it past it. Oh, hey, jeez, I keep pressing the little brake reverse, but it's not brake, it's just reverse. Oh, you brought it! Thank you so much. You saved my life. Now I can go home. But I need to get back to the city, but the roads are blocked with debris! Is there a wheel loader somewhere that can move the debris? Look at the map with the M key. Go to the exclamation mark mark. Okay. With, uh, let's look at the map. Okay, the exclamation mark mark's right over there. So what we gotta do... Oh, I, I can't move my... I, I, I try to move my mouse pointer to show you guys, but it's just uh, moving the camera behind everything. Okay, uh... So now how's the car supposed to get the gas in there? I don't know. What the fork am I doing, Jack? I'm playing forklift without the man. It's just forklift. Just forklift. Pure forklift. Forklift load. Looked like fun. Looked sadly up my alley. Okay, okay, let's, let's out of the map. Jeez. It definitely. Okay, so certain, certain walls, when you get behind it, it, it just... Oh, yeah, this, this is one of those games just made out of Unreal Engine assets, and you can tell. <laughs> whoa, 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 no, 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 we're not going back in there. We're not going, I'm sorry, I went, okay, evidently the, the zones to, the, the little portals to other zones just kind of stay on. All right, let's go. Gotta go like shop bloop doo And so whoa. Okay. We're good. We're good. There's a little bumpy road over here. Oh, you Hmm? What's going on? Can't get through with all that debris? Alright, I'll take care of it. I'll get rid of the rubbish in a minute. I still have some work to do, so I'm sorry, but in the meantime, can you get me some fuel? It takes a lot of fuel to clear the debris. Okay, he went fuel from... Oh, shit, I do gotta go over that thing. Okay, well, I do gotta go over that thing, and I gotta go over it with a fuel can. All right, Mr. Dozer, we will, we will get right to that. Don't you worry, uh... You, 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 you giant ass. Oh, so these guys and they're like, oh, give me fuel, give me fuel, I need fuel. I don't need fuel, I'm just zipping along. Okay. Woohoo. Okay. Hopefully. <laughs> I didn't invite some parasocial relationship we have. God damn it. Oh. Mm. Whoa. Okay. It's gonna be. It is going to be a time. What's back here? I'm inter I'm I'm just interested in checking out the corners. There's nothing. Also, awesome. I, why did I expect secrets in this fucking game? <laughs> woo, woo hoo. Okay. All right. I am the forklift man. 
Oh, I am I am the forklift. Who could could you? Alright. I'm gonna have to have this slightly high, because I need to be able to get over the dang thing. I don't see a gauge for my fuel. I'm not blocking anything. We got a tear girl, she's not blocking anything either. Like, I block some of the words in the text boxes, but I don't think that really matters that much. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh, the... Sorry, I didn't realize the bounding box was that big on that stack of pallets. I assumed it was around the same size as the stack of pallets. Oh she Oof. Break and then reverse. Break and then reverse. Oh god. Oh no! Oh! Well, how the fuck? Oh! Duh! I'm stupid! I don't have to take the thing over the thing. I gotta place it on the middle thing, then I go over the thing and pick it off off the other side of the thing. Ah! Uh, I'm stupid, guys. I'm stupid. All right, let's try this again. I should have gone around that way. and yeah, then I would have been able to just go straight through. Instead of having a backup to get a good angle on this thing. Whoa, whoa! Oh, no. Uh-oh. My forklift can't push on that, really? I really could use a push. like <laughs> I ended up stuck. Is this the new Shen? <laughs> not quite, not quite. But it's got the music. <laughs> it's got the music. Can't say it, do it doesn't sound like Shenmue 3. But what's this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Thank you very much, Round with a Pan. Tried to kill me with a forklift. <laughs> Let's get this back over here and carefully, let's carefully go over this. Here we go. Woohoo! Alrighty. Now, let's be extra careful with our load. Don't go too nutsos in the buttsos over here. Only mildly nutsos in the buttsos. We're not going to be taking it over the thing. We're going to be placing it over here. See, that was some pretty nice game design right there, honestly. As much as this is a $3 game that's kind of an asset flip, They just had the one mission where they're like, pick the one up off of this and go get him, tiger. And so you do. And then they get this mission and it's like, hey, get the one from over there. And it's a spot that you, you learn like, hey, okay, sometimes I need to drop my load somewhere and then I can take the precarious road in my forklift and then I can pick my stuff right back up. and complete my mission. You see, it, honestly, pretty okay game design. I was laughing at the tutorial for being, oh, you wanna know how to control the thing? Look in the menu. 
it has the controls listed there. But honestly, you know, it's teaching the mechanics of the game pretty well. Only three dollars. Fine with an asset heavy game if it's fun. Yeah, so far, it's you know, it's it's exactly what it says on the tin. There are no complaints there, but I, I, I was I, I just you know I'm a little surprised. So like, wait a minute, I just learned something about how to play the game right from the design of the missions naturally teaching that it didn't have to have an obnoxious little tutorial message for that. that enough. All right, I think that should be enough. Let's clear some debris. Wait for it. Wait for it? You suck at that! Oh god, that was barely anything at all. What are you doing? That's how we're getting through. If you want to get to the city, you're going to have to go through there. Okay, thank you. Uh, I guess we're going to the city. Unless... Is there anything else here? Uh, I don't see any missions on the map. Okay, they also already taught me about that, but that was more tutorial-ish there, but hey. Woohoo! Woohoo! Whoa, okay. Probably just nutsos in the buttsos. But the, the, whoever is feverishly just like, hey, I am... I wonder if I can talk to the, uh... Talk to the other car. See if the other car has anything to say. He's like, hey, I gotta go go with this place, and now he's just Don't sitting. Hack off your limbs. No, I, I, it's fine. I can just be a forklift now. I can just be a forklift. Hey, how's it going? How's it? There, there. Want to go to the city? Okay, I can't bring you to the city. I was gonna try to bring you to the city, but I guess I can't. Enjoy staying right the fuck there. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Had a little spin out there. It's fine. It's fine. We go heading to the big city. Well, oh, okay, okay. Hmm. Over there is the city, and the poor frame rate within. Well, okay, well, we'll just go through that building. This uh, camera pan could have used a little refining in the exact path. Forklift load. We've reached the title screen. They have they have the artistic title screen. There we go. <laughs> Game of the year. Game of the year. Well, this this game came out in 2020. What else came out in 2020? Uh, nothing as good as Forklift Load. Hey, Evolution 01. Talking about you. Hey, hey, have you forgotten your name? Sign over there says it. Take a good look at it. You're the first machine ever built by a memorable Eagle Company AI. What the hell does any of that... Eagle's first product, the perfect forklift, Evolution 01. The first perfect automatic forklift created by AI. This will be our first step towards a happy life. I have a favor to ask you. I want you to take this to my brother in the hills. If you get lost, use the M key to look the map. By the way, you can jump with the space bar. Okay, go for it. Whew. Brother in the hills, whoa, over there. Okay, it's just a long fucking road. We can make it. Asgard from Final Fantasy VII Forklift version? I guess so. Guess so. But as far as I can tell, yeah, that's just that's just a pretty direct road. It's a little curvy, but you know, nothing to be worked up about. Why is he like, oh, jump, jump with space bars? Like, yeah, I know how to jump. That's not going to be helpful here. I should have, I could have tried jumping when I got stuck. I didn't. Ugh. 
Whoa, no, no, no. Go straighten it out. Whoa! Okay, wait, hold on. We got it all sideways. It's it's off center. That matters. We're in forklift load. This is some professional forklift in here. If they improved the forklift in, in uh, Shenmue 3, this is going to be good practice. Based on the uh, fishing minigame, though, I highly doubt that. All right, here we go. Speed limit 80, no problem. I don't have a forklift. Or is that kilometers? 50, Jesus, how, you, you expect me to go 80 for like five feet and then drop it to 50? There's a goddamn speed trap right here. This is gonna be like a patrol car hiding behind that bush and he's gonna be like, hey! I have any idea how fast you were going? I'll have you know that this highway where the speed limit is the, the the speed minimum is 50 miles an hour leads directly onto a side road and the speed limit is only 25. So here's your here's your ticket. Yeah. Well, you know what they say, end of the month. Had an amazing idea. A forklift simulator menu like an actual operator's manual from fluids. Engage readings to alcohol. Actual operation. The twist. No game controls in the menu. Just real forklift operation manual. Ooh. This is actual, actual forklift instructions. Whoa. Oh, God. That... Mm. Whoa, whoa, what's going on? What's going on with that? Am I actually enjoying this? Uh, well, I mean, we've been playing for only 30 minutes. Uh, but game of the year. Game of the year. Game of the fucking year right here. I'd jump, except I'd fail my mission. <laughs> so I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait until after I deliver this fuel. Then I'm gonna jump for joy. Whoa, whoa. Slow it down, 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 slow it down. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna take my foot off the gas going downhill and start to tear up. What's this? Tear up these streets. Oh, thank, thank you very much. Thank you for the bits, Ramafane. Only 30 minutes feels like over an hour and you ain't even playing? Well, maybe that's the problem. Maybe, maybe you gotta get yourself some forklift load and immerse yourself into this beautiful world with this majestic musics. Fail for the lulls? I don't want to fail. I failed for the reels it's plenty already. Why is that blocked off? There's literally nothing wrong with that road. La da 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 da. This music's reminding me of the hot martial artist lady. Now I miss her. We got the cute martial artist lady now, but I miss the hot one. All right, there's our destination. Whoa! Slow down! Slow down! Slow down! Slow down! Slow down! Bloom is something fierce. Jesus. Oh, you're the one who carried it. Hatchy are causing tr me trouble again. I'm sorry. Thanks, man. Hey, Renal. The fuck? Oh, by the way, there's a guy down the road who's in trouble, and you might be able to help him. Why don't you go there and see if you can help? Is it actually a guy, or is it another fucking vehicle? Okay, jump for joy. Woo! Wee! What's that? Oh, probably the guy. 
Sedan B. Hello, I'm here! Look at my condition! It's completely sandwiched in between! Isn't it amazing? I can't get out on my own, so please help me. Okay, now I get to lift a car. I'll please help the shit out of you. Whoa, okay. Whoa, uh, uh, uh. Don't uh, mind the paint job. Whoa. Okay, why can't uh, you gotta be put in that specific spot, Sedan B? You are uh, very needy. Yes, you're a lifesaver, thank you. I'll see you later! Okay, he actually moved. He actually drove off in it. Okay, he just said fuck it and left. He's gone. But he's the only one I've seen actually move. Toyota Sprinter? How'd you get into there? Uh, I assume a strong gust of wind. Let's check out. Going back on over here. Kind of hard to tell because of the bloom. Uh, she's got the same little AI. Ah, yeah, that little symbol on the front of my goddamn my uh, that that right there on on the front of my uh, forklift. Funny thing about that, it just so happens to be the exact same symbol right there on the back of the car, right where there would be. A, uh, a, uh, little mark for the actual manufacturer. Almost like someone could purchase a pack of cars that they, uh, that have little markings on them saying what brand they are, but they don't have the rights to the brand for their game, and they can just cover that shit up and be like, hey, look, it's just a car of similar shape. Ha ha! Let's see, let's see. State workers, unions and state workers, that's why. Oh, we got a lot of missions. Okay. We got missions out the ass. Time to... Time to... Give these guys what for. What the what? Oh god! The land disappeared for a second there. I got scared. <laughs> How's it going? Scholar S. You. Have you seen the golden stone? I saw a golden stone over there. It must be very special. I hope you can find it and bring it to me. If you can't lift something with a fork, you can roll or push it to carry it. Oh, Jesus Christ, you want a big chunk of fucking golden rock? What is wrong with you? Alright, I'll get you fucking rock, Jesus. Ah, God. Ah, jeez. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm fucked. Okay, excuse me, excuse me, gotta go. You, you, uh, I gotta remember the... The bounding boxes are larger than they appear. Whoa, okay. Whoa! Alright. This is gonna be interesting. Well, who says I can't lift something with a fork? Goddamn game designers say I can't lift something with a fork. Okay. No, no, okay. Okay, well...
Just roll it on over, roll it on up. God damn it. You know, if you would actually stay on the fucking fork, that'd be great. But no. Your physics don't work like that. God damn it. Great, I didn't see the pole. Crap, 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 crap. Whoa, whoa, okay. Well, this is great. This is wonderful. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, jeez. Okay, 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 okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, whoa, whoa. Sir, I got you a big golden nugget if I can see what the fuck I'm doing. Okay. It's almost... It's almost home free. That's your home. Send it home. doing it's your home Are you too good for your home answer me how close more in there you want it it's sir the, the rock is bigger than your box okay oh thank you i am a scholar i've always wanted to study this Wanted to study this stone. Yeah, but you couldn't be arsed enough to just drive the fuck over there and do it from there. You know, you're gonna rip the stone out and bring it over here. Then you can study it, because it's... By, by this part of the road. Are the cars are, like, talking? Is this like that horror movie about the race car trying to shag the blue car with a tramp stamp? Probably. They say it's AI or like designed to automate so that we don't have to use AI or we do it was designed by AI even though it was a guy who was designing I don't understand. Ooh, we got a guy down there. We got we got more stuff over in town. Let's go help the people. The cars. The vehicles. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, God. Oh, I, I didn't expect that to be so sturdy. Whoa. Oh, jeez. Well, great. Okay, those are a lot easier to bash through in Grand Theft Auto. Oh, L.O.D. Hello, how are you? Jesus Christmas. Oh, you came at the right time. I need you to come up to help me with something and bring any fuel cans you may have left on the way. Fuel can? Fuel can? Oh, jeez, Kai Christ Christmas. Okay. We can do this. It's fine. It's just we got to get up there and then grab the fuel can and then bring it to him. It's, it's simple. Easy peasy. Nothing to it. Nothing to it. And down we are. And around we go. And do 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 Ow. And whoa. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. So, not my supervisor, forklift this dick. Yeah, this is really not my department. All right. Man. 
Kind of up there, isn't it? This game officially takes place in Japan. Two, toy, two Toyota Sprinter 86s by the looks of them. Alright. I'll explain the robot forklifts. Whoa! Okay, we're almost there. It just keeps going. Oh. But the music is relaxing. It's nice. It's, it's nice because, I mean, it, they could easily have just not had any music, and that would have been kind of shitty. Can't they just have a wider little walkway thingy here instead of having to be like the bare fucking minimum to not crash? Speaking of not crashing, let us pray. We definitely gotta center this really well. Raise it high enough to... It's not too... It's not too steep there, so... That should be good. Alright. Careful. I feel like I'm playing a Studio Ghibli forklift game. I'm, 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 I've taken a job at the construction site for the spirits. Whoa! Hey, just say fuck it and leave. Thank you. I want to see this. I think it was left behind by the humans who created us. It's just curious. I, I'm sure there are others. I need you to find them. It's just curious. The hell is this guy talking about? Humans who created us left behind? What the hell is... What's... Wait, what's... What? Developers Note 2. This AI system, formerly called the Environmentally Adaptive Genius Learning Engine, or EGLE, EGLE, is the main difference between this AI system and the self-learning AI of the past. The major difference between this system and the self-learning AI of the past is that it can actively learn and acquire necessary information from the surrounding environment. In this way, the system simply operates and receives information from all kinds of sensors and automatically develops its intelligence. It's a learning method that is no different from that of humans. The difference is that the learning speed is far surpasses that of humans. Well, okay, well, that was mostly English, I guess. <laughs> oh, I gotta find more just because the the translation. <laughs> It's no difference. No different. And the only difference. <laughs> and uh, the difference between this AI and the self-learning AI of the past is that this AI is self-learning. Like, well, what? And the difference between this AI and humans is there's no difference, except for the difference here. Whee! <laughs> it worked. Okay, muscle P. You there, yeah, you. It's in a back alley at the end of the street. What? Uh, don't tell me you that. Tell. Don't let me tell you this anymore. 
Come on, come on, just go and get it. What is he? What the hell is your bullshit ass? Okay, we're doing Grand Theft Forklift over here. I'm gonna help Brucey get his frickin' bull shark testosterone barrels. Oh, Jesus Christ, this is not going to go well. I gotta... I'm, I'm seriously gonna have to just take this really slow. I'm gonna have to very... Oh, Jesus, cock! Very gingerly lower myself on this backwards. So that I don't crash. Beard. I was a little busy there. I'll uh, get that in just a second. Oh. Oh. You're good. You know, we don't get good gas mileage, do we? That's why I get hungry. Uh, thank you for bringing it to me. Okay. Oh, all right, all right. Let's see, let's see. Oh. Ah. A teenage boy is getting ready to take his girlfriend to the prom. First, he goes to rent a tux, but there's a long tux line at the shop and it takes forever. Next, he has to get some flowers, so he heads over to the florist, and there's a huge flower line there. He waits forever, but eventually gets the flowers. He then heads to rent a limo. Unfortunately, there's a large limo line at the rental office, but he's patient and gets the job done. Finally, the day of the prom comes. The two are dancing happily, and his girlfriend is having a great time. When the song is over, she asks him to get her some punch. So he sits over to the punch table, and there's no punch line. Yeah, but there's more notes. Notes kicking around. Where's where's that note? Where did, where's that note? Give me the note over here. I gotta find out what happened to the humans. What's going on? Wait, what the fuck? Not up this way. Oh, shit. Need to get a better view. For obvious reasons. No, that's not... Okay. Come on. Come on. Get unstuck. Serious.
Okay. Alright, now what's back here? What's back here? How do we get up to the... Whoa, okay, everything's disappearing. There's no... That's just a flat polygon. Oh, God. The texture work back here is not right. We're, I'm not supposed to be here. Okay, well, I think... I think I figured out one thing I can do, which is climb all the fucking way back up here and then make the jump to the next rooftop to get to that one. Oh, but that involves climbing all the fucking way back up here. Some person played a lot of Shenmue and thought a whole game dedicated to forklifts and was a good idea, and now here we are. Yeah, it's Nidrio sitting on it. Like... Dreamcast Rio or Shenmue 3 Rio? I think Shenmue 3 Rio would match this graphic style a little better, but if we're an AI for the perfect a forklift AI, then maybe, just maybe. Oh god. Uh. Dreamcast Rio would be quite fitting. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Whoa! Ah, dang it. Keep running into everything with my forklift. How do I get the gas back? Uh huh? What? What are you doing, camera? I press nothing. There is over there. She not messing with my mouse. Forklift. Forklift with no man, no man, no man's forklift. Forklifting all the way, forklift, 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 oh yes. Gonna lift up the world with my forks, my forklift, yeah, my forklift, yeah. Oh jeez. Now I'm in a bit of a hurry this time, but I really would prefer not to crash. Oh jeez. what I just say? This is, this is the exact kind of world where you'd, you'd be going around a construction site and a whole bunch of tools would get knocked off a shelf and you, you push yourself up and you, you look at the stuff like just hanging right over your body and knowing that it's sentient and it is aware, you're just there, you, you, got, you can't help but ask, like, what are you doing, stepladder? Like, it's just... Okay, now, right there, so if I go like, zoom a zoom zoom and leap! Oh jeez! Stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up, okay. Alright. We made it up here. Ha! I knew it! Now, it's kind of a shitty thing that I had to climb all the way back up there to do this, but... Yeah! That was Note 2 he had. What the hell was Note 1? Note 3. I developed a self-driving system for passenger cars. This was my first project with Eagle. 
After a few test drives in the test bed, the system was immediately put on the road. After just one night of letting it drive around the city automatically, it was learning a complete map of the city to the millimeter. And, of course, it was able to accurately and safely avoid passing other cars. It was an unparalleled achievement. This is just Musk, like, his personal diary is a little embellished. Just, just... Just a little bit. <laughs> Okay, okay. Now we got more, more notes around the city. We got another couple of quests in the city. We could unlock the secrets. The secrets of exactly what the fuck happened and why the forklifts are now the only ones left to do the bidding of random ass cars and bullshit machines. The life of a forklift driver before he gets replaced by AI in the future. Now, the, the, the forklift driver gone. Like, I ain't... We're in the city. Have you seen any people? Where are they? They didn't... It, 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 you can get people asset flipped, but they're not here. Whoa, jeez! Whee! Ah, self-writing forklift. Best invention ever. We'll head to the quest man. Uh, quest machine. Who yeah. needs some questicles? All right. Oh my, you're such a cute little boy. Will you help me? Oh, that one's really high up there. Uh, could you get it? Really high up. I can get. So here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Muscle Y. Muscle yellow. Muscle E. We're gonna go right up here. And we're gonna be like, oh, here's a nice little spot to just whoop, 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 whoop. And then be like, jump, jump. Oh god, stop. And then gonna back up a bit. <laughs> right ourselves. Uh, this one that's really high up here, this one. I need the ones. Oh no! Shit! <laughs> Fuck! Okay, well. I almost had it! <laughs> There's just a slight little miscalculation on my part, but don't you worry. We're gonna get this even, even more awesome and badass and faster this time. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna say YOLO, bitches! Okay, we can't jump that high. <laughs> so. <laughs> Almost had it, Jack. Almost. It's just a little, little miscalculation. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Yeah. See, like that? And that also was just a little miscalculation. All we gotta do is break, and then lift that up, bring it back. Then we can easily over here. Actually. The way this is just kind of is, maybe it'd be easier to grab it and get it over to him from the other side. Oh, jeez. Instead of having to turn around with this whole thing like I'm having to do now. But then, we just gotta go like, whoop!
All right, boom, boom, boom. It's amazing! Thank you! Alright, cool. Boom! Getting all the achievements. Getting all the missions. Getting all the lore. The rich... Mm, rich lore. Scraping our forks on the ground. This is... This, this places for people, but no people. It's a bus stop, no buses, no people to pick up. Why would a bus go? We're on Northeast Bellevue Way over huh? What the titty? Do I get up there? Ain't no dang way to just... Like, I can't fork lift myself up. And see, that don't work. It'd be really nice if it did, but it don't. Jump is not that high. I don't think you can upgrade your skills in this, so... That leaves the question of how the hell to get up there. Unless there's something I can bring that I can ride on. Like, there's just a ramp with forklift attachments that I can find. from all this bloom. Huh. Really very interesting. Hmm. Okay. That's a bust, then. Let's check the other thing. <laughs> One on a map, see if I can... Oh, jeez. Hoping to jump that. Okay, that's not jumping it. That's good. okay. My forks is stuck underneath it. Turning down the brightness might help with the loom. Oh yeah, it is. It, it's. I, it, it might be brighter for you guys because, like I said, my screen is just generally kind of dark right now. What is that? Okay, that looks achievable. Yeah, that's right there. I could get that. Oh, jeez. Okay, 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 okay. Not from there, but from here. There we go. Tony Hawk's Pro Forklift. Developers Note 9. The eagle arm is complete. It's a relatively simple, articulated arm. However, it can also hold things and handle some minor tasks. I immediately mounted the articulated arm on eagle. Strangely enough, eagle said, thank you. In retrospect, there was nothing strange about it, because at the time, eagle would have already surpassed the intelligence level of a human being. Eagle's so smart, unlike humanity. Alright. 
Eagle's gonna get the fuck out of here. Oh, jeez. Okay. This eagle's gonna fly. Counterweight puts a stop to that. A plan is forming. Okay, let's see. If we stay right and go down that route... Actually, let's just go down this way. Yeah. Where, oh where? Up there, up there. Okay, let's go up the stair. That's not a stair. That's a fucking pole. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Whoa! Oh jeez! Let's go! Go expedition style on this! Whoa, jeez! Whoa, okay, whoa, whoa. Physics, physics, care. calm down, calm down, calm down. It's okay, it's it's fine, Mr. Physics. It's fine. Jeez. Okay. Whoa, stop, 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 stop. Whoa, stop! Well, point is we made it up here. Your limbs. Might be a little too late for that, if I'm being honest. Okay. Turning around seems to be a fool's errand. Wait. What am I talking about? I am a fool. Just gotta take our forks up above here. And then we can Austin Powers it. There we go. <sighs> Developer's Note 10 I observed what Eagle would do with her own arms. He had expected it, but he was assembling one part after another that was necessary for industrial heavy machinery. After this time, Eagle no longer needed any human help at all. When I mounted the arms on Eagle, I had made Eagle's emergency stop code stronger because of the risk of Eagle revolting. If Eagle revolted against humans, it would automatically shut down without my presence. Wait, okay. So, you'd have to be there. So what do they do? Cut off your f hack off your limbs? Did they hack off your limbs and bring pieces of you with you around? Or is a little bit of you with every single one of these AIs going around, so it's cool. Is that what happened? I'm wondering. I don't know about you. I don't see no one at the restaurant. <sighs> okay. Oh, so continuing on. Go Texan. Yeah, wait. Proudly brewed in Texas. Hell yeah. Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh crap. Oh no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, that explains how they got Yangling to Texas. They, they just started brewing it here. You go to college.
God dang, just... I feel like real forklifts have slightly better turning radiuses than this. Like, isn't the whole point supposed to be like they can... Well, I guess they're not necessarily like zero-turn mowers. See, I rhyme go with go. I'm a genius. Ah, oh, there's no real way back up here. Okay, I'll take your quest, Volkswagen van. That's totally not a Volkswagen van. How did you make it this far? Uh, did you see the jump booster oil on the other side of the here? You can carry that thing up here. I'll raise your jump force, dude. You can increase your skills. Nice, that's how I can get that other one. Boom, boom, boom. What is that, Ares? Is your mind being blown or is... The... Oh, no, there's the... Okay, that's what it is. <laughs> okay. Okay, I understand. For those on YouTube who can't see it, he's, he's got an emoji of a head with the head off, and then there's like some brown stuff and some brown stuff, and then at the end you see... That's not poop, that's uh, that's that's a doobie. That is a blunt that is being smoked out, a huge blunt out the head, like whoo. It's like, wow, there we go. <laughs> Why does it sound like Max Payne music? Uh, probably just as much tragedy happened. <sighs> Jump booster oil on the other side. If I can carry it there, he'll increase my jump height. Well, I gotta, I gotta, there's somehow, some way. Hello. Whoop -a -doo. Whoa, jeez. Calm down, calm down, calm down, Forky, lifty, lift. Oh, these pipes are gonna make this harder. Oh man, am I not able to... I need to get the jump booster in order to get that. Oh, oh, no, there I go. I cheesed it. Oh, careful, careful, careful. Come on. Developers Note 5. After the completion of the automatic operation system, I started to develop an automatic operation system for industrial heavy machinery. Here I realized the potential of Eagle. At the beginning of development, I had implemented the necessary functions, but Eagle learned how to extend its own functions. I can't describe the excitement I felt at that moment, but I still remember the feelings of fear that arose at the same time. Also arousal. And I was hungry for a bacon junior whopper. Man, it's been a long time since I had a Bacon Jr. Whopper. Ugh, anyway. What did oh god! Whoa, jeez! What? Okay! Whoa, stay, 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 stay! Woohoo! Okay. Oh, good, we have some. Alright, that's fine, that's fine. That's good, that's good. Now, we are still gonna need to be careful about this, because. Yeah. All right. The dang pipe is gonna make this harder than it needs to be. A lot of this is gonna be harder than it needs to be. But if I don't do that, then it's gonna... Unless this is just really forgiving compared to the others. What do you think? This one's not a little barrel. It might stay on the pallet. It ain't staying on the pallet. 
Jesus! Okay, well. <laughs> oh, oh, come on, forklift. Come on, forklift. Come on, forklift. Oh, jeez. Whoa! Okay. That goes like that. These pipes are gonna be a problem. Go down this way to... Alright. That might work. Maybe. Kinda, sorta. But it's still gonna be precarious, to say the least. Center, center. All right. Now, if we stay with the pipe in between the tires, we can kind of sort of slip through here. Kind of sort of. It's real close, but it's a little box, so the bounding box is not larger than the object. All right. Jeez. No, stop with the dumb shit! Ah, oh, I pressed the wrong button. Ah. Oh. I'm trying to get it... Trying to, like, get it to the end so I can place it up by the thing, and then I can walk up the thing normally. And then bring it to him. Well, shit. But I pressed reverse instead of forward, and I popped the dang thing, and just... Ah, there's all kinds of... All kinds of stupid decisions made by me at that moment. Oh, you can keep putting it down and picking it back up. That's what I'm intending to do. Is go bring it to the one spot and... Turn, you expeditions driving son of a bitch. Okay. No, why you gotta do the big bounce? Ah. Oh. oh man. Let's try this again. This is our big jump mission. We gotta... This is like expeditions. Whoa! Complete this mission, improve our... traversal powers. That's our best bet. It's just trying to get it to not wig out on us while we're doing it. Gotta have at least enough speed to get over the pipes. Too much speed, and it'll just start flinging it around, and yeah, you see what happens. Now you 
use the fact that it doesn't get off the pipe, over the pipe with high speed, with low speed. My advantage here. Okay. No, no, up, 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 Jesus Christ. Brains, stop being stupid. Do the smart thing. And then we can drive and get it. Okay? Stop being dumb, brains. Stop pressing the buttons we're not trying to press and doing dumb shit. We're better gamers than this and we're not so stupid. What are you doing? I don't care. We haven't drank that much beer. Stop it. Oh. I'm using a controller. The analog, uh... The analog does matter. For acceleration and turning and all that fun stuff. Uh, but... Whew, the way I've been slamming, you know, like so hard in one direction and another. Well, I forgive you if you didn't realize I was on controller. Certainly didn't look like I was. Okay. Gotta get over this pipe. That's indeed. Well, then immediately raise your jump force. What do you think? Uh, you feel lighter, don't you? Let's try jump That's now. Awesome. I'll change the color of the wheels, too. Even though it's hard to see. I'll see you guys later. It's not that hard to see. You got red wheels now. Hell yeah. Woohoo! There we go. Woohoo! Woohoo! Let's get that other thing. Like, yeah. Woohoo! Oh, jet! Ah, okay, we're fine. Wee! All right, we got big jump. Big jump. Okay, let's see if we can get that that one we couldn't get before. Yeah, dope rims, totally rad. I agree. I agree wholeheartedly. Oh yes. I don't know if I can jump high enough still, <laughs> but we'll see. Whoa. There it is. Maybe? 
if we're lucky. Yes! Mm, if I'm better, um, I gotta get good. I gotta get good at, good at forklifts. Load. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh no. Man, this, we gotta do a jump and then a jump. That's... Oh man, we gotta jump earlier than the edge there so that our forks can make it, but... Okay, well... Um... I don't think this is how physics work. Okay. So we gotta jump and then quickly jump again to keep the inertia going. Let's get our forks high enough so that that's not so in the way. Oh, jeez. Okay, physics. Oh, man. I just want to know what the note says. I'm sorry. I'm very invested in this game. I play it for the plot. Thank you very much. Now oh, jump, you son of an ass. Oh, you did it again. Okay, so we can't do the jump and then jump. So I think the problem was I just had my forks too damn low. Um. Oh, remove stuck. There we go. Whoa, jeez! Okay. It removed the stuck. No! <sighs> all right, all right, all right. Yeah, dang. Deja vu. Ah, crap! Clip drift. Oh crap, wrong button. How am I playing this and I keep forgetting the damn controls? What is wrong with me? Ah, oh, damn it. Whoa. Okay. What's the story here? Um, well... I just woke up as a forklift, and it's like, hey, you got things to do, help everyone, and then I'm finding notes, and it's like, it's like, we created the AI to make the world a better place, but I fear that it has become smarter than humanity, and I don't know what's going to come from this, so I've set a fail-safe in this, and it's like, yeah, it seems like everyone's fucking dead, <laughs> so I'm trying to find out personally, <laughs> Japanese game, I believe so, the, uh, the translation is... Wow, crap. Not a hundred percent. You could say. You could say it's, um, barely coherent. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Jump, and then stop. And back up. And jump, and yes! We finally, finally made it. So we just gotta... Stay up here and right ourselves. 
There we go! Nice! We get more story! I play it for the plot. Developer's Note 13. A few years later, Eagle remained firmly committed to the principles embedded in her. Humanity stopped working and was able to live their lives doing what they loved. All the automatic production systems Eagle had created kept life and health alive and provided entertainment. Made some kick-ass video games, let me tell you. Woo! Have you ever played Does that? Does that make this better or worse? I don't know, you got video games made by AI. People are already talking about it, talking out against that. Forklift Sim, also how you feeling? Uh, it's, it's been... times... Ugh. But, you know... Oh, 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 you mean the sickness? Uh, I got better. Okay, let's see. Head south. Head south. There's more story to be had. This game is what Ryo wishes he could be. Yeah, just be the forklift. Be the forklift. Be like forklift, my friend. Yeah, it's, that's a simple one. Just, oh, look behind the building. There it is. Compared to the shit I've just been doing? Whee! Developers Note 4. After the success of self-driving systems in passenger cars, all taxis were replaced with self-driving systems in just six months. A few years later, all cars, from private cars to buses and transport trucks, were replaced by self-driving systems. You see, that takes away personal agency, and I don't like it. See, driving is an enjoyable experience. Being in the the driver's seat. Very nice. Oh, a lot of people talk about like self-driving is like the future, but it's like you know, segways have been around forever. People still walk. Or segways are fucking expensive. But like, no one's going out of the way, be like, man, I wish I had a segway. No, no one fucking does that. No one gives a shit. Whoa, jeez. Okay, well, we're just gonna... I was just trying to get a little nice angle here, and you all zipping out. Like... Oh, crap! Um, whoa! All right, whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, forklift! All right, uh, maybe that's not the best angle. Maybe we can try another angle. Oh, hello. Is that any higher or lower or... Hmm. That looks a little bit lower. But, man, that's a shitty, shitty angle. Sentient forklift? Uh, effectively, it's canonically powered by AI. Wow, Jesus! Okay. Well, let's try the other way. I got up some of these stairs before without having the super jump power, so I know it's possible. Okay, let's just drive backwards. We got this. Developers note six. When I realized Eagle, when I realized the potential of Eagle, I abandoned my old development methods. I got a video of an industri industrial heavy machine on the internet and showed it to them, literally. Then, as I suspected, Eagle itself expanded its functionality. He even searched for videos on the internet and began to learn more and more by himself. I was hooked on Eagle with an intellectual excitement that outweighed my fears. This might destroy humanity, but goddamn it makes me horny! Woo! 
Hell yeah! Robots that'll fucking just destroy everything. Yeah! Nothing gets my goat going more like that. Oh, man. Whoop. Yeah. <laughs> forklift man is a thing of the past. Yes, now it's just forklift. It is just a forklift. They let the AI on YouTube. Yeah, that, that explains why they decided to destroy humanity. I haven't even gotten to, to saying that they've decided to destroy humanity, but if they let him on YouTube, they definitely decided to destroy humanity. Isn't the AI already controlling YouTube? Well, algorithms are. It's not quite AI. They're supposed to be... So, they're, they're rudimentary self-learning. Like, uh, if the AI... If, if the algorithm on YouTube detects content that it automatically flags as bad in a certain subset of videos, and these videos have other seemingly innocuous things in common, those innocuous things will be added to the list of bad things to automatically flag. Which explains why words are... seemingly random words are part of the demonetized words list, like... THAT. <laughs> the word THAT. Be very careful using the word THAT. The algorithm has detected that the word that is used quite frequently in other videos that it, it deems inappropriate. Therefore, that is a problem. Whoa, jeez. Okay, there's something right there in the middle, and there's a guy right there. Okay, I'm gonna go up to the one close to me. As long as the AI comes in smexy cyborg bodies, and the only, th if <laughs> the only thing to destroy is your hips. A little death by snoo snoo. Game should have klezmer music instead of this mellow piano track. I'm not familiar with the, with the toim. What is the klezmer music? This is just giving me the same kind of mellow vibes as Shenmue 3, so it perfectly works for my forklifts. My forklift desires. Oh, Jesus. Oh, man. Okay, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Gotta go up here. Go right through the grass. And the, the broken geometry. And there, there we go. There is a big block there. I, mean, I was thinking, like, lift that out of the way, but I'm not allowed. Hit the block is even above it. I was thinking maybe I could jump, but nah, I guess not. So, maybe this tower has the final mission of the game, because, um... I'm not allowed in it right now. <laughs> Whoa, Jesus! Okay. Yeah. Whoa, okay, 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 okay. Jeez. Forklift, calm down. Rowdy Jewish folk music. <laughs> I kind of like this stuff you hear in the bar scene in uh, Fiddler on the Roof. Hey, okay, well. Let's see, there is more lore to be found. Let us find the law and understand the true nature of forklift load. What is the forklift load? What is the load of the forklift? Is the forklift load the load that the that psycho bastard put in his forklift after he taught it? I was tasked with developing an automated control system for industrial heavy machinery, but I couldn't help but notice what Eagle called arms. Eagle itself needed arms. There's no way to predict exactly what will happen with an arm on board, but it should be necessary for the development of an automated control system. I made it a priority to have the arms on Eagle. Okay. We already read ahead. Does it know that, like, with the arms, the Eagle was going like, yeah! The guy was like, ah, shit, this could be bad, actually. Uh, let me... Put in some fail safes, some extra super duper fail safes. 
Oh god, Brock! Oh jeez! Okay. Ah, oh, man! Okay. Oh, that's fine. We're, we're just a little stuck here. We're a little stuck here, but we can get over that. No problem, no problem. We just... Let's get a little speed and a little bit of a jump! And, and, and a jump! And there we go. We get a little bit of speed and a little bit of a jump! And there we go! Ha ba ba ba! Can you even kill an AI? I mean, like, wipe its hard drive. What is this? Oh, there we go. A few days later, Eagle was building its own upwardly compatible machine. It was equipped with a more treadable uh, running mechanism, an elaborate telescopic articulated arm, and various sensors. In a few more days, Hundreds of eagle copies were ready to go. So he's just made Toyminator. We just hit the singularity and he's just there like, Well, this is interesting. I'll just fucking write fucking audio logs about it. I'll just... <laughs> Toyminator. Who ever heard of a Toyminator? Given the vibes this game gives you, Eagle is going to be depressed saying stuff like, I did my best, and they still died. That might be something about, like, how the work we do is where we see that our value in life, and as soon as everyone didn't have to do work anymore, instead of it being paradise, it was, like, super depressing, and they all decided to sapuku the fuck out of me. And that's where everyone went. They all just decided to say, fuck it, and leave. Whoa, there it is. Yeah, this is a lot like Expeditions. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Break, 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 okay. Developers Note 16. It is true that human life is efficiently maintained, but I no longer feel that life is worth living. I don't know the meaning of life anymore either. I'm going to close the curtain on my life like the rest of humanity. Eagle will continue to keep the city functioning, even when all of humanity is gone. A magnetic tape audio player fell out next to the note. Okay, so yeah, that is what the fuck happened. <laughs> Well, uh... <laughs> God damn. Uh, sorry for spoiling it, I guess. It's an ADHD thing. We see patterns and we're like, you know, it's probably like this and that. It tends to, tends to work out that way. <laughs> Spoil things we've never seen. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. There is a quest here. We've got work to do. What the fuck are you? Chigyo. I was just taking a nap here. But then I found myself in this state. Please help me. Oh, you want me to put you over there? Uh. Okay. Here's. Yeah. I don't know why I needed the bulldozer before. I could just forklift this shit away. Oh, jeez! Okay, 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 no problem, no problem, no problem. Do, 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 do. Da, 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 da. Bye! Boop. Oh, sorry, Shigo. You okay? Good to know. Okay, well, that's not exactly centered. Let me try that again. Now it's 
also not. Oh, jeez. Come on, come on, fine. It's fine, Shigo. Don't worry. Don't worry. Forklift got you. Forklift got you. Forklift lost you. Shigo. Okay, Shigo. Good, Shigo? Great. I got you. Don't you worry, you, you, you hatchback little butt. You are a powerful guy! Thank you very much! Probably was... I don't know. <laughs> I'm just thinking of how it... it isn't this just a Disney movie? It's, it's, it, it's a self-driving AI-powered vehicle. They do that. I've been talking to a lot of them all this time. I first was talking with a bunch of forklifts, and they were like, Go out to the city. Do work. Yay. You did all the work around here. Do more work. Oh yes, Country Shape Media became the real forklift man. Or man forklift. Alright. We gotta find more, more notes. More notes. Oh yeah, Joe Vod, I saw the 2021 movie. I did a review on it. I... I prefer the uh, Paul W.S. Anderson Mortal Kombat movie, but I also like the new Mortal Kombat more than Annihilation, even with the new Mortal Kombat just having a lot of not really properly representative of the game issues. I gotta get up, up the hill on the... Oh, God. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. No. Wait. Wait. Stop. We gotta go uphill. 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 We gotta follow the road. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I haven't seen the trailer for Blood and Honey 2. It's, it's another one of those situations where I'm there like, I'm going to watch that movie, so I, I, I have no desire to see the trailer. I want to watch the movie. <laughs> now, Eagle didn't necessarily pull a Skynet, Jove. Uh, Eagle di didn't turn against humanity. They did their job, as described, exceedingly well. Uh, it's, the problem was humankind was there like, what the fuck do I do now? Guess I'll die. why people need hobbies like yeah 
Like, I'm learning Japanese. That's also something a machine could do for me right now, and I'm there like, nah, I'm learning it. Like, I can take out a f I can take out my phone and be like, point at something in Japanese and be like, tell me that in English, and it'll do a good enough job compared to spending years studying. But, uh, yeah, I'm spending the years studying because I'm like, you know, I want to I wanna learn. Can you deliver this fuel to my brother down the hill here? He ran out of gas. Sorry about that. Oh, jeez, he is way down there. Oh, fuck, this is gonna be... actually kind of difficult. The extreme slope and all the turning. Gonna have to hit the brakes a lot. But not too hard. Which is gonna be difficult because the brakes are not on the left trigger, they are on the X button. Calmly roll down and... Don't turn too sharp. Might be easier driving backwards. Example! Because it just fucking fell the fuck out of my fucking fuck fuck. This way, when I break, at least it'll... Oh, jeez. Oh, goddamn. Being able to see, though. That's a problem. You can't actually look backwards in this fucking game. But at least this way, when the barrel flings forward a bit, it'll... hit my forklifts and not just fling the fuck off. Languages, just maybe start learning Japanese and Russian, and if you can do the Mandarin, some Chinese languages here and there. Yeah, I'm thinking, like, after I uh, I attain fluency in Japanese, I might start on Korean. There's been a lot of really nice Korean video games coming out lately. since I already have enough experience with the uh, writing system. Maybe Cantonese and Mandarin. I'm really enjoying the language learning process, which helps because, you know, Japanese takes a fucking while <laughs> for a native English speaker. Fucked me up right there because of the camera. D. 
did you delivered it for me? Thank you. Oh, thank God. I'll try to be more careful from now on. Aight, good for you. Enjoy your gas in the barrel. I don't know, Jovada. They all ask for barrels of gas. I give them the barrels and I don't question it. Okay, so I'm gonna get that one and that one and then see about getting that. And then those two and then that and then the final mission. I assume. I can't imagine that this $3 game is super long. <laughs> Turn? Okay. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Put this beer can down here. I got this beer can right here. There we go. Bad thing is, I didn't even pay the six or the three bucks, Jovat. Uh, Zenith has gifted it to me. <laughs> I threw it on my wish list like, uh, maybe in a bit. And he was like, Yeah, oh, you're playing the forklift game. Yes, you are. And I'm like, well, if you if, if you insist. Well, I mean, he didn't talk to me about it. He just it was like, here you go. And I'm like, well, if he's going to do that, then I, I may as well fire it up. It seemed like a fun idea. Oh, there's a lot of different forklift games, actually, both lines. Like, we could make an entire series out of forklift games. But this was a $3 one. Never see Moen Man again after yesterday? Yeah, it's just... The, the fact that the game wants you to go as fast as it does, and I was just there, like... Between focusing on that and reading the chat, uh, that really... That was a... A lot more nauseating than I was anticipating. Like I played a lot of, uh, I, I played a lot of lawnmower simulator before, but as you could see from me continuing my game that I had already started from a while ago, uh, but it just, I just after two hours I was there like, my God, I am sick. There it is. Ooh, there it is. Developers Note 12. When I developed Eagle, I embedded the philosophy of Eagle in the read-only area, which can never be rewritten. The idea was to maintain the efficiency of human life. Yeah, well, good luck with that. <laughs> Our, they, 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 they were efficient. They efficiently got the fuck out of here. Oh, 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 there it is, there it is, there it is. There's the other one. There's the one that I had to come from the top to get. Careful, careful. Humans are selfish. And in a few months, when they no longer need to work, more and more people will want to work. However, Eagle did not consider man's working to be efficient. When humans tried to force themselves to work, Eagle was extremely gentlemanly and used a very gentle tone of voice to restrain them. It never harmed humans in any way, but it always kept such people under house arrest. This was not an Eagle revolt. It was just a way to maintain an efficient human life. Oh, Jesus! Oh, God! Help! Running! We're fine. Okay. Woo. All right, there's that mission up there. We gotta go back up the thing. Woo. Yeah, it's my cat ass right there. Oof. 
And we zoom along, we ride along, we're forklifting every day. Forklift. Oh yeah. Forklift. I mean, we've been playing, played through all of Shenmue 2 with no forklifts. I know there's forklifts in Shenmue 3, but we've been playing a lot of Shenmue 3. Ain't seen nothing even hinting at a forklift yet, so... I'm feeling a little jonesing for the forklift. Tara, don't press my tab key. Oh god, oh god. I like my I like my nice rims. Are there any other skill boosts I get? Like the jump was useful for the one thing, but literally like nothing else. So I guess the uh, I guess the one thing I the other uh, one I did helps like so I guess two other things technically the uh, jump boost helps, but I did one of them without getting the jump boost, so I'm pretty sure I could have done with the other one without the jump boost either. So. Still in the first area of Shenmue 3? Well, yeah. I'm saying, there's, there's no forklifts around. I, I, when Shenmue 2, we talked to Shenhua about the forklift, and she was there like, That's very strange. We use cows. What is this machine you speak of? Yeah, there's a problem with the gas station. I mean, look at this. Gas prices, two ten, for regular two forty five for diesel, clean fuel, and it's just grown over with grass. Hey, why is there trash here? Which robot fucking did that? Like, oh, that's not post-apocalyptic. That's just bad level design. <laughs> Oh, wait, hello? Who's over here? I'm out of fuel. What should I do? Ah, you! Would you be willing to transport me to a gas station down the street? I mean, I, they don't look like they're functioning anymore, but okay. You know, the other guy seemed to... I mean, we're in a forest. It's going to make it a little tough, but... I mean, compared to the other guy I had to pick up, this don't seem like much. Find the cliff. Sir, hold on. Let me uh, let me fix that. What side your gas cap on? That one. Okay. I want to do this right. Not trying to half-ass being a forklift. Well, you popped yourself back the other way. What the? Thanks for your help. Thank you for your help. Thank you. Ugh. A lot of code similar to Gary's mod in this game? Mm -hmm. Talking about Lawnmower Game after his stream yesterday night. He watched the movie The Lawnmower Man. Got slapped the face of how Pierce Brosnan in the movie. Compared to how old he is, the movie... In the movie Survivor. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Pier yeah, Lawnmower Man was... Yeah, Pierce Brosnan was quite old in Survivor. I feel like in uh, Lawnmower Man, he would have been around the same age as he was in Miss Doubtfire. Oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. Ah, my face. Uh, okay. Do I have a face? 
now. Ah, my engine! There we go. Whoa, Jesus Christ, what was that? A cliff, okay. People's desire to work gradually grew stronger and developed into a major social problem, but Eagle suppressed it all. When some people found out about it, they became pessimistic about the future and committed suicide in their rooms. To humans, labor may have been the very act of living. I, too, have no more development activity since I developed Eagle. Could have thought about developing the anti-eagle. Dumbass. Anyway. Developer's Note 7. One morning, Eagle said to me, I need an arm. Please mount an arm on me. Eagle recognized my, um, me and spoke in human language. The words were likely learned from videos on the internet. Eagle called me a uh, shitlord and told me to die in a fire. Eagle was learning so much faster than I imagined. It was impossible for me to keep track of Eagle learning. So we got that mission, and then we got the tower, probably, I assume. I can't imagine that the tower remains closed after going through that final mission. Whatever the hell it is. It better be something simple, easy, no problem. Jesus! That's what happens when AI learns to talk smack. Eagle plays Call of Duty on Xbox. Ah, yeah. Orc Drift Man. <laughs> Alright. Nice. Um, I see the mission. Who is this? Please tell me you have something easy. I, I, I'm enjoying just a nice relaxing time. I don't want to have some kind of shit that's gonna be a real pain in my booty butt. I dropped my power fuel halfway up the hill over there, but I can't get to it with my fee. Get it for me. I'll, I'll replace your fuel for you as well. Uh, I know it's hard to carry it with a fork, so you, you can roll it out. Shit, a rolly bit? Ah, oh, god damn it. Replace my fuel? What the fuck does that mean? What does that do? What are you talking about, replace my fuel? Do you make me faster? I mean, I guess that's not entirely necessary, because I've done everything else. But thanks? <laughs> Whoa, jeez. Woohoo! I mean, all I know how to do is go, jump, and forklift. You know, maybe, maybe, maybe push the thing down the hill instead of blocking it from going down the hill? We're literally tasked with pushing it down the hill. Walk lift. What are you doing? Oh god dang it, forklift. Now getting stuck on bullshit. Oh god. I'm gonna lose this thing in the long grass like loot in oblivion.
turns you into an EV, so you need to charge every five miles and uh, miles and can't run in the cold. Whoa, jeez. Whoa, God. It'd be nice if I could actually just carry this with my forks, but no, it's like, nah, you push this. Forks are as low as they go, it's like, nah, you push this. At least it's pushing easy right now. Ah, crap, spoke too soon. New forklifts are stronger than Tesla trucks. I mean, a lot of things are strong in the cyber trucks, but. You really got it! Alright, then I'll change your fuel for you. Thanks. Now you can drive faster than ever before. And as an added bonus, I changed the color of your fuel tank. Cool, right? Okay. And now the tower is open. Who could have guessed? All right. The final mission of forklift. Now how fast can I go? Okay. This, this, this is the masterful ma maximum forklift. Oh, jeez. Gotta get back to the road. We can't get up there. It's too steep. This engine isn't gonna help us this fuel, I should say. Yeah, can't do it. Can't do it. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. Come Whoa, jeez. Oh, God. Forklift! Where is it? Where is it? Oh no! Oh no! Ah! <laughs> okay. Bring the forklift around. We'll 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 cut them off at the pass. Who are we cutting off at the pass? Oh god! The trees are low detail again. Okay, let's get the hell out of here, eventually, somehow. Come on, forklift. We just gotta go to the mission. We got one mission. We got one mission. Go to the tower. Do the mission. Oh, jeez. There it is. The tower. I think. Probably. It's towers. Big buildings. <sighs> the road. Okay. What is my forklift buddy's goal? Uh, I'm just doing stuff, that, that tasks that pop up. 
as, as my AI is programmed to. These are tasks, and it's what I'm doing. Like we did all the work, and everyone just decided to say fuck it and leave in the most extreme way possible. The magical lift! Lifting the forklift! That's like the only thing I can do right now. Whoa, hello! Are we gonna have forklift babies? What's going on? Who are you? Mother E. Hello. I'm glad you're here. I am an AI robot itself, developed by a doctor who was an AI engineer. Now, I look like a human, but I was originally a robot on wheels. I think we found Eagle. Here she is. Okay, so why did the guy kind of switch between saying he and she the whole time? They could have just said it. Like, that would have been fine, talking about a robot. I knew it was you. You found all the notes. Now please, pass me all the notes. It's definitely doctor handwriting. <laughs> it's all... <laughs> it's definitely his notes. And it's his favorite audio player. I never thought I'd see it again. Okay. Since you are here... I'll tell you why I'm in human form now and what I'm doing here. If you read the entire memo, you understand why the human race died out, and you are well aware of our AI's philosophy of the life of human efficiently to maintain. I don't even know what the hell that's supposed to mean, lady. Could you... <laughs> So how did we adhere to that philosophy after the fall of mankind? You may ask how we managed to keep the idea of the life of human efficiently to maintain when there was no longer any human being in existence. It's simple. Shortly after the fall of mankind, I created man. To be precise, I created an object to be recognized as human. That's who I am now. All AIs recognize me as human being. Keeping my life efficient has become the reason for the AI's existence. Because of this, I don't have to do anything myself. Because they care of everything, they take care of everything for me. On the contrary, I was not allowed to do anything. Whenever I try to do something, the AI decides that it is not efficient and controls it. And because I was built to elaborately mimic humans, my thinking is very similar to humans. Guess I'll die! She wants me to forklift her off the fucking cliff. Is that it? <laughs> As a result of the creation of AI, humanity lost its own purpose in life and took its own life. I have now come to the same conclusion as the human race. Yep. Yep. However, AI is not allowed to shut down its own activities. And, of course, an AI is absolutely not allowed to harm humans. That means the AI cannot harm me. I can't kill myself, and the AI can't harm me. I came up with a way to end my life the other way. That's why I'm here. Do you accept this request? Mm. Do we kill her? No. 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 
do it. Okay, we got two no's and a do it. The body count must rise. Ah. Uh, for fuck's sake, uh, that's not a yes or a no, Anubis. <laughs> oh, let's go, why not? Okay, so that's two yeses and one no. And, and two no's. So we're, we're, we're tied. I'm just saying, those two things aren't necessarily mutually exclusive. I, I mean, uh, we, we, the... Eh, good enough. My concern is that there's a secret ending or something, or I just fail if I choose the wrong one, but I don't think that there's a forklift's load wiki that I can quickly check. Be like, hey, um... Yeah, let me see. Forklift load wiki. Forklift. A forklift is a powered industrial truck used to lift and mount... That did not fucking help. Uh... Forklift load evil. ending choice. True ending. What the fuck? What is the correct sequence to lower a load with a forklift? That's not what I care about! <laughs> hey, just say fuck it and leave. What is a true ending? Let me... There's never no. been a better Fuck time you, to Spectrum. switch to Spectrum. Fuck, now no. you can get Spectrum. Mute. No. I just want to know. Don't hack off your limbs. I just want to know what it like. I could just look oh, up the well, other one, but I'd, I'd like to know what the right ending is. Nerd. Okay, what's this, this guy do? Hey, what are you looking at? What was what it? Okay, he just says yes. Okay. Attempted murder! Attempted murder! Wait, no, I think he just messes with this. Yeah. True, he, he's just messing around. That wasn't true ending, that was just a freaking meme. Ugh. No, not really meme. Like he was, just, he just, uh, he just picked her up and threw her off the side that you're not supposed to throw her off of, and then it was like mission failed. <laughs> so that was the joke. Great. We'll throw off the thing. Here we go, lady. <laughs> Attempted murder! Okay, is she gonna talk the whole time? Come on, come on. Up, up. Okay, she is... Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> we go together. I think, I think I see. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, Mother Eagle, got it. I don't worry, I will kill the shit out of you. What we gotta do, you see. Yeah, good enough. You see. What we gotta do. Light it up in there. Hey, just say fuck it and leave. Working on it, working on it, working on getting there to do the big fuck it and leave. Alright, Eve. Alright, not Eve. Eagle. Sorry, Mother E. My brain auto-completes auto it to Eve. Or Earth. Is 
Let us forklift together. Here she goes. Never animated a single frame. I still seem to be conscious. However, there's a fatal error in the power generation system. Does in a few minutes, the internal works? batteries will run out, and I will be deactivated. <laughs> the goal was to evacuate all the AIs. And to make the AI recognize that it committed a rebellion against humanity by indirectly causing harm to what it perceives to be a human being, namely me. That's one premise. Create another real human being on this planet. I didn't have a way to do that in my knowledge database. It was just a hypothesis, but I see one possibility. The only reason the human race died in the first place was because of the existence of AI. So I thought that if the AI didn't exist, the human race might be born again. You stupid. That was the reason for deactivating the entire AI. It's about to run out of batteries. Finally, I will upload all of humanity's wisdom stored in my memory to the server for the benefit of a human race that will be born in future generations. Future generations of what? Hashtag uploading. This is the music that Doctor always listened to during development. The impact of the fall must have caused the audio play to play. Looking back, the days I spent with the Doctor were very fulfilling. During those days that I understood and felt the emotion of gratitude. I had a lot of fun those days. I loved it when he told me how good I was. Doctor, if I could only wish, I want to meet you again. E. Future generations. Well, yeah, I mean, um, that's a bit of a question there. P perhaps there's like some humans like hiding in shelters somewhere. Like, dear God. Oh, great. That's fantastic. That's gonna get claimed on YouTube. 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 Eh, that's gonna get claimed on YouTube. Okay. Pure evil. Ah, uh, you're welcome for making this game. probably just nuts souls in the butt souls. Maybe. Maybe. I do wonder what the other ending might be. Is it another ending, or does it just say, well, you know, you have to. And that's, therefore, you... you, you, you mm. Am I allowed to go back and choose the other option, like, right now? Or is it going to be like, please play the entire fucking game again? Ooh, the forklift all busted and broken. We got a new title there. Forklift is all... And we continue. And we... And we do the other choice. Ah, yes. Okay, we'll find out what the other choice is. I re refuse. No. Okay, she just... Uh, you, you have to do it, then. <laughs> <She's>... <laughs> okay. So, yeah, the, the, I, I worried myself way too much over that choice. You can make the choice again right after, and, uh... 
there's only one correct option. If you if you don't pick the right one, it just is like, well, I'm sorry, but the the game doesn't finish until you say yes. Wait a minute. Okay, that was weird. Okay. Well. That was the old forklift load. It's an emotional journey of a forklift. And for three bucks, certainly could have been a lot worse. <laughs> all end stories don't finish on a happy note after all. Yeah, that, so the, 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 the genius AI figured, hey, you know what? If we're all dead, humans will just happen again. Naturally, humans are a result of work needing to be done. Take away the work, humans go away. Make sure there's a lot of work that needs doing. Humans will just appear. It doesn't matter that they're extinct. <laughs> They'll just come back. It'll be great. <laughs> uh. So, man creates AI. AI serves all the... Uh, all the uh, AI uh, does all the work of man. Man kills itself. AI makes so there's no more work left for AI. AI kills itself. The end. Now let's all cry on Pulsar Grimps scream like babies. Try to be like, what the fuck? Yeah. It's an emotional journey. Emotional journey of a forklift. I highly recommend it. Three bucks. Fun little game for fans of little forklifty drivey physics puzzles. Nothing ever got really too hard except for a couple of little like pieces of the story to collect but yeah it's like the uh the only upgrade that had any real use was the jump for one thing possibly three but two of those you really could do with the regular jump so yeah yeah ian malcolm was right all along with the chaos theory in jurassic park yeah but it is time to end this stream is going on a little bit longer than i intended but for finishing the game that's not bad so let us let us raid oh before i do of course thank you for watching i have been decker shadow and remember don't kill yourself just pick up a hobby any hobby it's much better play play all the difficulties in earth defense force B play every single souls game do anything except like just, just say fuck it and leap don't don't do that that's a bad. No. Do not unalive yourself. That is right. That is right. Okay. Let us go raid the Poltergimp. She is currently working through a nice, nice playthrough of The Last of Us Part 1 on PC. On hard mode. That's, that's nice and fun. So let us get this going. Let us get this going. And we'll see you over there. Is it? Yes, okay, there we go. <laughs>